here at the LA Kings training and practice facility the team prepares for the 2015-2016 season. Last season was a big disappointment for the team and their fans. But if the pattern from the last five years holds true, this could be another Stanley Cup season for the LA Kings. Uh, training camp's going good. We still got uh, a lot of guys here and uh, you know a few more games to play. So just getting ready and getting prepared for the season. If you look at their overall game from last season, the LA Kings played very well, better than the record shows. This offseason we had a lot more time to, to get our bodies and our minds ready, so uh, you know it's been good. Uh, the guys looked ready and you know physically and mentally. The problems were not enough goals from the top shooters like Ansa Kapitar. The big center had his worst season since being a rookie. Kapitar needs to get back to his usual form to help the LA Kings win games. I'd say we improve that is is personnel related. I think guys like you know guys have had tough years last year in terms of scoring Brownie Kopi and we look for them to obviously Lucha coming in somebody's going to re replace uh, Justin Williams offense so they will. Goalie Jonathan Quick was very good except in the shootout. If the LA Kings can avoid going to the shootout, that will add some wins to the record. You know, you want to focus on things. You want to get better with uh, certain things, and this is one of them, definitely. And of course, Quick can improve his play as well. The defense was really good last season, but there's still room for improvement. Uh, our lineup changed uh, changed a little bit, so um, you know it's going to be important to to make sure we have good starts and and uh, help out five guys defensively as well. So we got some new faces coming in, and. Uh, you know, defends our, our identity, so make sure we gotta we gotta do it. There are some new faces in the locker room today, looking for a permanent spot in the roster. Yeah, you know, there's a lot of young guys here, a lot of guys fighting for jobs, and uh, you know, you can see that the young guys are hungry, and you know, they look good. The LA Kings just play a couple games with the Arizona Coyotes, and they have four more preseason games before the season starts October 7th at Staples Center against their old rivals, the San Jose Sharks. It's, uh, you know, it's been a long offseason for everyone, the fans, GMs, coaches, players, so uh, it'll be good to open against the Sharks, and you know, that's going to be a good match. Um, if we get a chance, we just have to cap capitalize. Obviously, special teams are very important, and, and uh, just put shots on that, create traffic. Just, you know, there's, it's no... It's not really science behind it, we just have to do what we have to do and, and uh, I'm, I'm sure we're going to do it. Which is, yeah. Yeah, you, yeah. Um, we play one game together. We have, uh, we have some work to do, but I believe uh, it's going to work. And, you know, he, he's a great addition for our team. Big physical guy that can, that can uh, put up a good number. So, um, you know, we have, we have quite a few games right now to, to work on it and uh, uh, we should be good. We just have to get used to each other. and. Uh, um, you know, work on things, and uh, we're three different players. So, as a combo, it should it should work, and we're gonna do everything we can to to make sure it works. Yeah, you, know, you work you work hard all summer. You work hard. You want to play games. Everybody wants to play. So it's uh, you know you just look forward to those opportunities when you get the chance to play and try to help your team win. This year's a little different, and especially with trying to find the right get some connection with guys on the ice and I mean if you look at it we don't who are our partners going to be on defense uh, who's going to play center with this guy or, so we got lots to look at so we got the guys and the guys knew know that coming knew that coming in and know that still that they're going to they're going to play from El Segundo California this is Claudia Gestra for the LA Post Examiner